Ma'asumin alayhi salam, we, we take permission to, to enter, izni duhul. You know, this month, this beautiful time, this moment on the day of judgment, when we will visit, when, when we will see the month of Ramadan al-Mubarak, literally Hadith has said that Kalqamari bain al-Kawakib. You will feel that, wow, this month is like a moon among the stars. Sitaro mein ek chand a gaya. Ramadan al-Mubarak a gaya. Lekin, we were waiting way before Ramadan, waiting and waiting and waiting to welcome this month for what? What is the reason? The reason is the heart of this month, the core of this month, the center of this month, which is just very near to us, maybe after a few hours. That is the night of Qadr, which is Qalb Quran, Qalb Shab Qadr, yeah, night of Qadr is heart of this beautiful month. So we don't want to just enter like an ordinary people. Yeah, like if someone call you, if you don't like that person, you will say, okay, come, hello, yeah, you know, you, you, you answer the message. But if you like someone, you say, wow, I have a message from that person. So inshallah, we are among those who are very special to Allah wa ta'ala. By the way, Hadith says, when our akhlaq is bad, yeah, when we are high in high temper, when we can't control our, you know, akhlaq, our manners, then Allah says, hmm, now he or she is not my guest. Otherwise, you know, that the moment we can control our akhlaq, we are the guest of Allah. The moment we are out of control, Allah says, oh, he or she is not fasting, you know? She is not because fast doesn't mean only for tummy. Fast means that that power of control which you have on your tongue, on your, you know, gaze, wherever you are watching, observing, whatever you are listening, whatever you are talking. So, inshallah, uh, first of all, inshallah, uh, the night of Qadr, whatever, what we have to do, number one, we have to thank Allah. You know, this is the night of thank, night of gratitude. We have to thank Allah for what? What do you think? For what we have to think? We have to think, you know, even, even we are fasting for, for thanking Allah. We have to thank Allah. We have to say thank you, Allah. Yeah, we have to sh show our gratitude for receiving why revelation book of allah you know that, that that book is so crucial for our actual life we need quran we have to say thank you allah you have given us quran the book of allah because of that we are fasting all 30 days do you know no you didn't know before so now you know, yeah? So now the night is approaching us, which is the night of revelation. Yeah, we, will, we are receiving that Quran. Like we have fast 18 days to reach to this. You know, you're saying, thank you Allah, thank you Allah. Every day we are fasting and saying, thank you Allah, you have given us Quran, you have given us Quran. Thank you Allah, thank you Allah. Now the night of Quran is there, alhamdulillah. So... Uh, there's a big message, you know? What is the message? Number one, our destiny, our decree, yeah? Night of Qadr means Allah will, Allah will send all his decisions about us according to our action, whatever. If I've done something very good throughout the year, Allah will say, oh, because um Maryam or Mansura or I don't know uh I much Zainab she has done something really good she's keep helping everyone without any condition so now I have to give her so much long healthy rich beautiful life you know she will enjoy her life year and year after so my decree yeah Allah is writing about my destiny according to my deeds because my deeds my pure intention 
my good akhlaq, the way I'm helping my parents, my siblings, you know, the way I am, I'm, I'm just good and very honest with everyone. Allah will decide to give you more and more and more gifts. So, so this is the night in which Allah is, you know, making our destiny. Number two, Allah is giving us the gift of Quran. So the connection, did you get my point? Yeah. The connection between decree, our taqdeer, and Qur'an. So we can bring revolution and change in our life by having Qur'an in our practical life. That is the only way, you know, only way. Therefore, inside the, uh, during the time of Shab Qadr, yeah, the best amal, you know, what is the best amal? The best of the best of the best amal is to think, to reflect, to ponder, to, to gain some knowledge. Knowledge means that light, you know, usually people, they say, what can we do on the night of Qadr? But I usually say, we have to think what we shouldn't do in the month of Ramadan and what we shouldn't do in the night of Qadr. Do you know Imam, Imam Ali alayhi salam, you know, the moment this, this month used to start, you know, the moment he, he would enter the month of Ramadan, he would not speak, only necessary stuff definitely, but with tasbih or with dua or istighfar. Istighfar, subhanallah, alhamdulillah. You know, zada se zada zikr, as much as it's possible. Like useless and, you know, just talking, just eating and just uh, spending the way our time, wasting our time. That is uh, sometimes lead, leads us towards, lead us towards committing sins, yeah? Because if we don't care the way we are talking, the way we are eating, if we are careless eater, then we eat so many junks. Yeah. If we are clean eater, then we eat only healthy things. The same way about tongue. So the best deed to, to be very, very sensitive about our actions that we shouldn't hurt our Imam is Zaman. We shouldn't hurt Allah wa ta'ala by our amal. That is the biggest thing. Biggest ibadah is to clean and, and, and just, you know, uprooted the bad habits which we have. Because this is the month of revolution, you know, change. Like, because this is the spring, yeah? In spring, we just see, put the seeds. So we are bringing it that change and we will see the fruits rest of the year that should if we shouldn't just think okay this is the list i want to recite this and this and this and this and I, yeah i have finished it alhamdulillah and the, then after reciting all those duas and ibadah maybe i'm the same person no that is not the meaning of ibadah you know the worship the ibadah you know this is the night of being awake, we have to be awake, awake of not just this eyes, you know, it shouldn't be awake only. This heart, you know, mentally, spiritually, this heart, you know, like we should be awake, like I'm, I'm, I'm thinking, who am I? Why I'm here? For what? You know, that is ibadat, okay? The main, the biggest ibadat is that I have to stop all uh, the channels of guna, like the channel from which I can do some mistakes and hurt my imami zamana is maybe my screen, maybe my tongue, maybe one of my friend, whenever I sit with her or him, you know, I get out of control. So I'm just saying, you know, this is if you don't change your friend, you cannot do the actual toba and repentance. So actual toba, you know, going back to Allah wa ta'ala can be happened when you are changing your lifestyle. Okay. So number one is istighfar, wara, just stopping all the 
um, yeah, channels of guna. And Hadith says very beautifully that, you know, on the night of Qadr, what happens, you know, all the angels, they love to come and visit you, literally you. They love, forge their forge. The angels, they come down, yumassihunahum bi ajnihatihim. They love to touch their wings with you because you are fasting, you are reciting Quran, you are bringing change in your, in your life. By touching their wings with you, they are just washing up all the zunub, all the sins we, which we have done before. Because Allah wa ta'ala just sent them before Shabi Qadr even. You know, Allah says, go, 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 go. I want to remove all the obstacles, whatever is between me and my, my, my servant, whatever bad deeds he or she has done, just remove it. I don't want any curtain between us, yeah? Because I want to shower him with so many blessings. So it's so beautiful. And the second thing which we have to do on the night of Qadr especially is remaining in the state of wuzu whole night. Yeah, whole life, life should be like that. But at least Ramadan and then in Ramadan, Shabi Qadr. You know why? Because in our prophet, he says, uh, I, will, I will recognize my lovers, my ummati, my people on the day of judgment by the beautiful fragrance of wuzu. You know, th there would be billions of people, but our prophet, Imam, Imam Asr will recognize Imam say, oh, she's so ah, she's Noor. I know Noor is always with the Noor of wuzu, you know? So that is our identity we need this beautiful wuzu which is a very powerful shield in our life so inshallah wuzu can change our life and in the amal the first amal which has written is near maghrib time on the night of Qadr, we have to do ghusl yeah we have to wash up our body so this, this ghusl shouldn't just watch our physically our body yeah and we say Allahumma ja'alni min al-tawwabin wa ja'alni min al -mutatahirin. I don't know what dua what kind of du'as you recite usually whenever you you perform your ghusl you know I love this very simple dua you know I'm always connecting this water the power of water with with toba with washing up our bad habits so Allahumma ja'alni min tawabin Ya Allah, you know, I'm just washing my, my, my I'm, I'm, I'm doing, you know, shampoo, but I'm saying, Khudaya bar ilaha, you know, you know, count me amongst mutatahireen, the pure ones, and accept my toba. Look at the beauty of Islam, always together, root, jism, root, jism, root, jism. We are the absolute balanced, moderate, amazing people because of Ahlul Bayt alayhi salam. Yeah. So the same thing is written in, in A'mal that you, you have to do. First of all, I said, such day shukr. You know, you have to do shukr. If you if you if you want to recite to Rakat Namaz for Imam Zamana Ajalallah Ta'ala Farajahu Sharif, you have to feel his presence too with the presence of angels. Yeah. So if you if you don't have that much, for example, uh, time, so even you can you can recite to Rakat Namaz uh, in sitting position or sometimes by walking. Yeah, like you're just, maybe you're helping your mom in kitchen. Maybe you have a small siblings, you know, you have to help out your grandma. So you have to cook something or, you know, make some tea for whatever you're doing. Yeah, you you make sehri, whatever, or, or your schoolwork. So you can just recite that uh, surah hamd and whatever you're reciting in, in inside your salah by walking when you're walking in kitchen for example and you're quiet you're not talking to other people you're just recite allah akbar and you're going here and there you can just be in any position it's not wajib to face qibla in that halat in that position yeah because you are praying while walking you can pray mustahab namaz you know, usually, mashallah, mothers, uh, they pray 100 rakat, yeah? Your moms are praying 100 rakats at least. But uh, I'm, I'm just talking for, for children, for young children. They can do 
their prayers if they have so many mustahab prayers so you they can do while sitting or while walking but don't miss it out you know you know imam zamana you know imam imam whenever he's praying yeah i, I always always miss his his qudu you know i'm just imagining that imam is in this position in ziyarat says ziyarat ali yasin as written uh, yeah, Imam Zamana, I'm missing your kunud, I'm missing your ruku, I'm, I'm just imagining about your sujood, and, and I'm sure you are taking my name. You are, you are saying, yeah, this, this Mansura, Yusuf, I, I just can read some, some names here. Yeah, Ishal, yeah, E-S-H, yeah, Ishal, and whoever, like Imam is just praying for you. Definitely. So, so, and, and you know, all the angels, they are coming down. I'm, I'm sometimes, you know, I feel Shabi Qadr, 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 yani, one of the meaning of Qadr is definitely great. And, and what another meaning is, this is the very uh, narrow and Qadr, uh, small place, this, this, this planet for angels, because all, kulluhum ajba'een, you know, tanazzalul malaika. All of them, they are just focusing this planet, earth. And sometimes I feel, look at the, the value and the, the daraja and the status which Allah wa ta'ala is giving to us that, you know, we are just a tiny, look at all the galaxies, but angels are just focusing to this tiny, small planet which name, you know, which call earth, just because of Ahle Iman, because of you, because of the Noor of Iman. So all of them, they are coming down. Therefore, this earth becomes small for them. You know, it, it will become very congested because of the presence of uh, all the Malaika and angels. And all of them, they are doing just tawaf of Imam Zamana. They are around Imam Asr Ajalallah Ta'ala Farajahu Sharif. So just start from now. Don't waste time. Recite as many as uh, many you, you can. Uh, surah, surah Qadr, Surah Qadr, Surah Imamat for Imam Zamana. Just recite so many salwat for him. Just give him so many gifts. Then he will see, wow, there are so many gifts from, from um, uh, what, Irsia John. So, wow, I, I have received my, my, my favorite gifts. You know, if you are sending every day my favorite dish to Iran, Qum. For example, I love, uh, we don't get uh, so many things here. Yeah, we don't get parate here. I don't know. So, so if you are sending good parate here, so I say, wow, Faiza John is sending kebab and paratha every day. I love Faiza. So look at Imam Zamana, how much he would love us. He will pray for us because Imam is going to sign. Imam is going to put stamp on our taqdeer and our destiny, whatever decree Allah is writing for us. So therefore, inshallah, we are reciting Surah Qad Namaz for Imam and Surah Qadr for Imam and we are doing Ghusl which Ghusl means Ghusl spiritual Ghusl Ghusl of our heart cleaning up our heart you know the Ghusl uh, in which we are just very sensitive after Ghusl we should be very 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 like fussy about our using of our limbs, you know, like where am I watching? What am I talking? What, you know, going in my head? That kind of strict, you know, like we should keep eye on our a'mal, our, you know, whatever actions we are doing. That is the ghusl, okay? Ghusl will make us reach to the best level of taharat, taharat. And then we have to pick up the, Book of Allah, wa ta'ala. We have to recite Surah Dukhan, yeah? So whenever you are, you are picking the book, you know, Islam, like Book of Allah, yeah? Quran. So Islam uh, truly believes on touch. So don't, don't just pick. And Bismillah rahman rahim I have to finish Surah al Kabood. Oh, yeah, Surah Dukhan. Oh, this Surah, this Surah, <gasps> Surah Rum. You know, no, it shouldn't be like that. Look, first of all, you have to touch the Book of Allah, wa ta'ala. You feel, you say, shukran lillah. You can kiss this book. You know, sometimes iftar time, you know, 
uh, we, we start our iftar with ruhani iftar. Like sometimes we go to haram and we kiss Zari of Hazrat Masuma and that is our iftar. Sometimes I kiss my, my, my children. I say, Hussein Jan, Rihul Walade Mina Rihul Jannah. Yeah, your khushbu, your fragrance is the fragrance which has come from Jannah. So this is my iftar. Ah, you know, you, you can do so many beautiful iftar and suhoor. So you can do iftar with kissing the book of Allah. Now, inshallah, sahri, sahri time. And you feel, because even hadith says sometimes if you, you are not able to, to recite so much Quran, yeah, rest of the days, inshallah, if Allah, Allah will give us long life. So after Shabi Qad, so you can just pick it up and just you can watch and you can say, Ya Allah, I really want to recite. I love your book. I love your message. This is the, this is full of love, but but I don't have time. Yeah, that is a not true excuse, but still, okay, I will recite only one ayah. But, but have that connection, that emotions. You know, you have, we have to show our emotions toward the uh, book of Allah wa ta'ala. So, inshallah, because, you know, uh, the month, uh, the night of uh, uh, Qadr, yeah, we are just putting Quran, yeah, keeping it on our head. And we are saying, Ya Allah, uh, this is my promise that rest of the year, you know, the place of Quran is here, you know, I'm not neglecting it. I'm not making so many excuses to not have this book in my practical life. So recite less, but with taqwa, with meaning, with message, with quality. That is really, really important. And, and you know, like Sayyid bin Tawus and other ulama, they says, um, if, if you are just doubting, should I, should I recite Dua Joshari Kabir or Dua Kumail or Dua, I don't know, between Duas or Dua, for example, Abu Hamza is Somali. So you can do Istakhara, you know, if, if you have like only one hour is remaining and you can do, you know, either this one or that one. So you can do istikhara and just pick that one and do it with, with heart. You know, that is very, very, very important. Okay, after Quran, uh, then uh, inshallah, we should uh, uh, say istighfar a uh, hundred times. Uh, but I don't know our, our young, young kids, if they can do 50 times in first night, then hundred times in second night of Shab Qadr and the third time in uh, the last uh, third, third Shab Qadr, like again, hundred times or, you know, hundred times Surah Qadr. So we, they can increase it, you know, night by night, gradually. Agar pehli hi raat mein sab nahi pad sakte, so aista, aista, aista padna shuru kare. Okay? So uh, sometimes I say, Ya Allah, thank you so much. You have kept uh, Laylatul Qadr in three nights. We are so lucky. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah, we don't have only one night. You know, we have three. Three. You know, this is, this is again one of the rahma, one of the mercy which we are receiving. You know why? The way we have approached uh, month of Ramadan, step by step, we were what? We were Rajabi first, then we, you know, stepped towards Sha'bani and then Ramazani. The same way is about Shab Qadr, night of 19, then 21st, then 23rd. Amazing, amazing. Otherwise, if, if it here would be only one night and maybe we were not prepared, you know, like. Sometimes when we recite uh, namaz is Zohar, yeah, maybe in Zohar we are not that much attentive. But Asr, you know, if, if you recite together, in Asr you feel more connected to Allah wa ta'ala. So we need, we need it. N uh, night of 19, the first night of Laylatul Qadr, you know, what, what according to hadith, what hadith says, why why Allah has divided somehow, not, not divided, you know, we don't know exactly which night is the actual night of Qadr, you know, so because the first night Allah is just making the planning, 
yeah the planning is there planning means taqdeer like uh, everything allah is just writing it down for example writing means in our language that um, insha allah uh, that person will get more uh, life healthy life so many uh, amazing gifts or uh, you know hajj and umrah and ziyarat and you know good school and college and whatever we we are asking from allah tabarak wa ta'ala allah will allah allah is just right allah is just deciding yeah deciding not just planning that uh haider rizvi is there yeah haider ko bahut kuch milega allah ne planning kar li hai theek hai this is the night of planning 19 the first night of qad okay the second night uh after planning the decision will be made by allah tbarak wa taala yeah the night of decision and the third night is the night where uh, allah tbarak wa taala will give a order to imam asr to just stand to just do a, to sign you know that is completely now done after that it's very very tough to change our destiny like because maybe because of my bad deeds allah has written that razia uh, i wanted to give you more more 40 years to live healthy life but you are not enough good so i'm i'm reducing 20 you will get more 20 years only with so many maybe difficulties so now what can i do now allah will say you know I, i i have this this month was month of rahma but you didn't receive it because of your some bad you know intention aapne rahmat ko hasil nahi kiya then what can i do hadith says only if i go to the hajj yeah and if i get to sit in the maidan of arafa the night day of arafa if i seek forgiveness that is the only chance you know allah can forgive my sins you know why what does it mean don't don't take it negatively iska matlab ye nahi hai ki allah mehriban nahi hai no 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 because ramadan mein you know every night every single night thousand and thousands people are getting rid of so many gunas unhe maghfirat pe maghfirat mil rahi hai रमजान में जो पाक ना हो सके इसके लिए फिर बहुत मुश्किल है रमजान के बाद पाक हो रहा है क्योंकि इसमें तो ऐसे ऐसे मुफ्त में अल्लाह पाक कर रहा है देता ही जा रहा है देता ही जा रहा है देता ही जा रहा है सो so, अगर हमने अपनी डेस्टिनी गलत बनाई या देन इट्स टफ इट डजेंट मीन दैट इट विल नॉट चेंज नहीं तकदीर के पाबंद है नबातात तो जमादात मोमिन फकत अहकाम इलाही का है पाबंद ठीक है वी एज अ मोमिन yeah if i am a true obedient servant of allah tbarak wa taala then i can change my taqdeer even after laylatul qadr but that would be not easy task yeah abhi easy hai abhi to itna aasan everything is so easy and simple to bring change to receive mercy to to just take so many ni'mat from allah tbarak wa ta'ala insha allah insha allah so insha allah uh, we are going to uh to do tasbih and tah- and istighfar and zikr of um, uh, allah tbarak wa ta'ala in this night i said whatever you like whatever you understand just choose those a'mal okay so i have told you two rakat namaz is shukr to rakat al namaz for imam asr and, and and we have to say thank you allah lamia shukriya aapne hame zinda rakha hame izn dukhul diya hame shab e qadr mein aane ki taufeeq di ya imam e zamana all the angels are coming to you unse kahe ki hamare paas aaye and literally hadith says um, night of qadr all the angels they just they just come to your house they knock the door of your house tak 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 even jibril including jibril can you believe it can you believe it and we should feel that agar the sign you know one one very very powerful indicator which says that we have received the salam of jibril and other malaika or not is what the sign is 
if you feel um, a bit change in your heart, like aapka dil jai, you know, your, your heart is broken and, and you shed some tears and you feel a bit, you know, your, your body is cheering. That means aapne angels ke salam ko receive kiya hai. Or Allah itna, itna, itna merciful hai for example only those people they are very stubborn or bahut bure log hai wahan angels nahi aate uske ilawa har jagah aate and then jitne aap paak hai as much as you are clean yeah by your heart by your thoughts by your action yeah as much as you are clean that much you will get receive the angels if you are not clean maybe they will remain a bit you know in distance with you because they are pure they are clean and they love only pure one so inshallah main main soch rahi thi ki ye wo mahina hai jisme amir al mu'minin alai salam apni routine badal dete the hamare nabi tamam aimma pata hai imam e zamana hamesha ibadat karte hai na is always in the state of ibadah but when ramzan comes even Imam Zamana, he, he changed his way of life and routine. So, how much we change? We change. We do change. We don't do anything here. Think, what have I done? Have I done more than that? Oh, oh, you know, I shouldn't talk too much useless stuff. Have I done more than that? Listen to more So, if we change our own mind, inshallah, this month is for us and this month is for us. It's better and better. رات میں تبدیل ہو جائے گا اور ایک اور جو آخری پیغام ہے وہ یہ ہے کہ اس رات میں اپنے مرحومین کو نہ بھولیں یا ڈونٹ فور گیٹ دیم اینڈ وی ہیو ٹو پری ٹو رکت نماز فار اور بلوڈ ون دے ہیو پاس فرام دس ورلڈ یا دے ہیو بیکم مرحوم اور شب قدر میں تو وہ دیکھتے ہیں دے آر ویٹنگ کہ کتنا گفٹ ہم اپنے مرحومین کو بھیج رہے ہیں یو نو دا پیپل آف برزا The way we say, Allahumma adkhil ala ahli al-qubur al-surur. I think that when it comes to Ramadan, all of the ahli al-qubur will be so happy. Like the Quran is so happy that we will become a mood of the Quran. The Quran is so happy that, Alhamdulillah, everyone is giving time to me. The same way the people of Qabr, or yeah, graveyard, or the people of Barzakh, they also say, Alhamdulillah, for us, every day, every namaz, after that, اتنی بار دعائیں ہو رہی ہیں سو so, بہت زبردست قسم کی ہم نے دعا کرنی ہے نماز پڑھنی ہے قرآن پڑھ کر انشاءاللہ آپ ضرور ایک سورہ یاسین پڑھیں اور اپنے مرحومین کو دیں ٹھیک ہے اٹ ول ٹیک فائیو منٹس دو رکت نماز پڑھے دیٹ ول ٹیک ٹو منٹس تو سیون منٹس ایٹ منٹس ٹین منٹس فار مرحومین وی ہیو ٹو گیو انشاء اللہ انشاء اللہ اور وی ہیو ٹو کیپ تھنکنگ about our aqa, our maula, Amir al-Mu'mineen, Abu al-Aytam, Imam al-Arifin. Because, you know, Allah ni kaha, you can't, you can't forget Imam Ali in shab qadr Therefore, you know, the way Allah has merged shab qadr with the, the, the remembrance of Imam Ali alayhi salam is very amazing. It's really absolutely astonishing because, uh, 19 is shab e zarbat of Mawla Ali, 21st is shab e shahadat, and 23rd is sabum of Imam Ali alayhi salam, Ali, 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 Ali. Yeah, one Quran is coming from up to down, and one Quran, Imam Ali alayhi salam, because of his shahadat, he's going from down to up to Allah tabaraka wa ta'ala. So Quran aa raha hai, Quran ja raha hai. We have to remember both Quran. Aayye, aayye yaad kare us, us aqa ko, us mawla ko, uh, jo mawla, jin ki zaban bataya na, Ramzan al-Mubarak mein, aap baate zyada nahi karte thay. Hamne kitni baate kar li? Baare ilaha par vardikara, عام بے مقصد بے ہدا گفتگو میننگ لیس باتوں میں ہمیں ہمیں بہرا گونگا بنا دے ہمیں بہرا بنا دے ہم غیبت نہ سنیں ہمیں اندھا بنا دے ہم دوسروں کے بارے میں زیادہ نہ سوچے دوسروں کی باتیں اور دوسروں کے عیب اور برائیوں کو نہ دیکھے آئیے یاد کرے اس امام کو جو جن کی زبان ہمیشہ ذکر الہی میں رہتی تھی 
لیکن شب زربت اب آہستہ آہستہ وہ بدن ضعیف ہوتا جا رہا ہے امام کی شہادت کے بعد اس زمین نے امام کو یاد کیا کہا اب وہ آنکھیں کہاں ہیں جو راتوں کو رو رو کر اللہ کو یاد کرتی تھی اب وہ ہاتھ کہاں ہیں وہ ہاتھ مٹی میں چلے گئے جو فقیروں کو مدد کیا کرتی تھی اب وہ پاؤں کہاں ہیں جو یتیموں کے گھروں کی طرف جاتی تھی اب وہ دل کہاں ہے وہ علی نہیں رہا زمین پر جو دل محبت خدا سے لبریز تھا السلام علیک یا اب الحسن یا امیر المؤمنین امام علی علیہ السلام سلام نے اپنی زندگی کے آخری وقت میں کہا تھا اے میرے بیٹے محمد حنفیا آ جاؤ آ جاؤ اسی کا بل حسین خیرا میرے بیٹے محمد میرے بات میرے مظلوم حسین کے ساتھ مہربان رہنا ہاں زاداروں امام علی مسلسل ادھر دیکھتے ہیں ادھر دیکھتے آپ کے سر زخمی ہے اور آپ نے کیا دیکھا ایک جانب دیکھ کر کہا السلام علیک یا نبی اللہ السلام علیک یا فاطمت الزہرا السلام علیک یا ختیجت القبرا پھر اسرائیل کو سلام کیا اور آپ کی روح پرواز کر گئی ہزاداروں آئیے اس گھر میں چلے جس گھر میں چھوٹے چھوٹے بچے ہیں آپ کو پتا ہے حضرت عباس کے ایک بھائی تین سال کے تھے جو امام علی کے بیٹے ہیں ایک پانچ سال کے تھے جب امام علی شہید ہو رہے ہیں اب مولا اس دنیا میں نہ رہے اب غیبت کا دور بھی آ گیا ہاں زادارو میں کہوں گی یا امام علی آپ کا بدن زخمی تو تھا لیکن آپ کو آپ کے بچوں نے آپ کے بدن کو دفن کیا آپ کے چہرے کو خاک پر رکھا گریا کیا لیکن مولا علی آج یو میں جمعہ ہے تمام فرشتے کربلا جاتے ہیں آئیے یاد کرے اے مولا علی آپ کا بیٹا حسین کاش بدن پہ سر ہوتا کاش بدن حمل کرنے کے قابل ہوتا ازادار ہو کسی بیٹے نے اپنے باپ کی قبر پر یہ جملہ نہیں کہا جو جملہ امام سجاد نے کہا ہے کہ بابا قتلوک ومن شرب الماء منعوک ہائے وہ مظلوم باپ جس کو پانی سے روک کر رلا رلا کر شہید کیا گیا لا یوم کا یوم کا یا ابا عبداللہ انہا لیلہ و انہا الیہ راجعون رضاً برضاق و تسلیماً لعمرِ کبار الہا پروردگایا یہ ماہ مبارک رمضان جو بہت تیری نظر میں عظیم ہے یا رب یا رب اس کا احترام کرنے کی توفیق ہمیں عنایت فرما پروردگارا ہمارا نام رمضانی ہمارا نام شب قدر کو درک کرنے والوں میں سے قرار دے پروردگارا خدا وندہ امام زمانہ امام زمانہ کے دعاوں میں ہمارا نام شامل فرما یا رب یا رب امام کو اس نے ظہور عنایت فرما خدا وندہ ہماری اولاد کو نیک سے نیک سے نیک سے نیک سے نیک تر بنا پروردکارہ قرآن کی محبت ہمارے دل میں ڈال دے کہ جتنے دن گزرتے جائیں قرآن سے پیار بڑھتا جائے پروردکارہ خدا وندہ جو بیمار ہیں انہیں شفا دے دے شفا دے دے شفا دے دے یا رحم الرحمین یا رب یا رب یا رب جو دنیا سے جا چکے ہیں خاص طور پر ناصر عباس محروم کے لیے ہم دل و چاہتے ہیں سے دعا گو ہے پروردگارا خدا بندہ انہیں جوار معصومین میں انہیں حضرت فاطمہ الزہرا کی قصہ اس چادر تطہیر کا سایہ انعیت فرما یا رب یا رب یا رب یہ ہماری زندگی کا آخری رمضان ہو جس میں ہم اپنے امام کے بغیر ہے امام ظاہر نہیں ہے بار الہ آج کے بعد ہر رمضان امام کے ساتھ ہم شبہ کو جانتال کرے آمین آمین
آل محمد ہمارے مرحومین کے مغفرت ان کے درجات کو بلند سے بلند تر فرما خاص طور پر مرحوم ناصر عباس کے لیے آپ سب سے التماع سے دعا ہے یا رب یا رب ہماری میزبان اور بانی اس عبادت فائز جان اور ان کے گھر والوں کو اپنے خاص حفظ و امان میں رکھ اور جو اس عظیم مجلس میں شریک ہوئی ہیں یا رب یا رب ان کی دعاؤں کو اپنی بارگاہ میں سن لے ہمیں شب قدر میں اپنی بہترین دعا بہترین تقدیر بنانے کی توفیق عنایت فرما سب کی زندگی کے آخری لمحات کو بہترین عبادت کی حالت میں قرار دے Thank you so much, Razia Bhaji. As always, I'm truly indebted to you and and, uh, and to all those who have participated. Can I please request a Surah Fatiha for me, Nasir Abbas, or all of the people who have participated in the Al-Fatiha? بہت سارے لوگوں نے دعا کے لیے بھی کہا ہے راز باجی جو بیمار ہیں ان کو شفا کلی عطا فرمائے آپ سب کے لیے دعا گو رہیے گا اور ہم سب کی نیابت میں ریکویسٹ ہے کہ زیارت بھی بجائے لائیے گا ان شاء اللہ ناؤ اف دیر اینی کوشچن اف اینی ون وانٹس ٹو آسک وی کین ٹیک دیٹ کوکلی وی ہیو اباؤٹ ٹو منٹس اگر کوئی سوال کسی نے کرنا ہو تو پلیز آپ چیٹ میں لکھ سکتے ہیں مگر راز باجی نے اتنا بیوٹیفلی ایکسپلین کر دیا اور اس کو اتنا سمپلیفائی کر دیا اور اتنا آسان بنا دیا ان شاء اللہ آپ لوگ سب کی اعمال اس شب قدر میں قبول ہوں ان شاء اللہ پردگار سب کی نصیبوں کو نیک فرما الہی امین الہی امین آئی تھنک نہیں راز باجی دیٹس فائن تھینک یو سو مچ ہم آپ سے ہمیشہ مستفید ہوتے ہی رہتے ہیں سوالات اور جواب دیتے رہتے ہیں پھر ان شاء اللہ فیوچر میں لیں گے بس آپ دعا گو رہی ہیں اینڈ تھینک یو سو مچ اچھا آئی تھنک آئی میوٹیڈ یو آئی جسٹ کوکلی ان میوٹ سوری یا ہر نعمت کی ایک زکات ہوتی ہے سو آئی ہیو دس نعمت آف بنت باب الحوا سعید معصوما So the part of this ni'mat is to be, inshallah, your representative. And you need to pray for your prayer. I understand that you have to pray for your prayer. And you have to pray for your prayer. And you have to pray for your prayer. And you have to pray for your prayer. Nasir Abbas, you have to pray for your prayer. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Inshallah. Azbaji, I think we just have um, one person who wanted to ask a question. If you have شب قدر میں موجود ہے امام حسین علیہ السلام کی زیارت الگ سے ہے شب قدر کی زیارت علیحدہ سے جی جی بالکل علیحدہ سے موجود ہے تھینک یو سو مچ راز باجی پلیز کیپ اس ان یور پریئرس میں اللہ انکریز یور لائف اور ہم سال ہر سال آپ کے اس علم سے فائدہ اٹھاتے رہے ان شاء اللہ اور وہ بڑھتا ہی رہے آپ کا علم تھینک یو بہت شکریہ تھینک یو خدا حافظ تھینک یو ٹو آل دوز پارٹیسپیٹڈ پرویندر کار آپ لوگ سب کے درجات کو بلند فرمائیں اور سب کے مرحومین و مرحومات کو بہترین مقام دیں اللہ شکریہ خدا حافظ